How's everyone doing today? Thank you so much for stopping by AJT Cards. We've got a very, very, very fun opening, at least for me. I've been so fortunate to get my hands on a box of NBA Illusions 2019-2020, all with the help of a friend in the area. His name is Mark. Thank you so much, Mark, for helping me out with this. He was able and lucky enough himself to get his hands on a box of the Retail Blasters and reached out to me and said, hey, I know that you've been looking. We try to look out for each other. I actually just recently found out that he's also into the collecting hobby as well. So this is something that we're trying to do to look out for one another and also people within the card collecting community to help out because it is so hard to get your hand on retail items that um, we want to offer these products to each other, you know, at retail price or help people out that are looking to open up these boxes or packs that just have a passion for collecting because if you go online and try to buy a box of these illusions, they are incredibly difficult to get your hands on. So, and for the price. So to me, it is a, a big plus to be able to work together with individuals and people on it and, you know, see what we can kind of come up with and kind of forming a little community. So thank you again, Mark. Really meant a lot to me. I know I told you that once before, but wanted to thank you again. So you can see in the background here, I've got my two PC items. We've got Celtics. We've got Marcus Smart's rookie card here, NBA Hoops. And then also another rookie card, a Mosaic Taco Fall. Not been getting a lot of time in the playoffs here, Taco. A few minutes in one game, but we'll see. So again, we've got the 2019-2020 Illusions. We've got John Morant on the cover. There are six cards per pack, six packs per box. They have Blaster Exclusives, Emerald, and Ruby Parallels. Oh, don't know if you can kind of see that there. I'll try to get the lighting on that for you so you can read, so you can see some of the odds. We're going to get into this right now, though. Open this up. If I could open it, need to get a box cutter. That'd be the, the way to do it. But All right, and again, I want to put this up there in case anyone wants to look at the odds. So you can pause it there. Very, very excited to be able to open this. I never thought I'd have the opportunity, to be honest with you, just given how hard of a product it is to get your hands on. So it means a lot to me that he was able to reach out to me the way that he did. So thank you again. I mean, this is really special to me. I love collecting and basketball is my favorite sport and it's so difficult to get your hands on this product. So we're gonna jump right into it. This is the pack design here. You got John Morant on the front. We'll get right into it and take a look and see if we can get anything special out of here. I've seen a couple pack opening videos, so I have a slight idea of what we're looking at, but hard, hard to say for sure. You never really know what you're going for. All right, I'm just gonna set this down so you can see the card design here. Very nice, the light is going to catch that pretty well. Um, so you're gonna see a lot of uh, shine, so to speak. But this player right here, Duncan Robinson, has been doing great inside the bubble in the playoffs there. He's been going off, been doing really, really well. And um, him and Tyler Hero have been playing great for the Heat, so it's not a bad card right there. Another bubble player that actually you know, has uh, been doing pretty well for the Clippers, Montrez Harrell, Dylan Brooks. All right, I have seen these. This is the Shining Stars. It's an insert. It's a, I don't know the specific type or the name of this, but it's a Chicago Bulls Shining Stars, Zach Levine card. I'm trying to see if it has a name on the back. I don't know the specific, again, type of this, but it is one that you can kind of see through on the back there. You can see my hand in the back. So different type of design insert there. Luke Kennard, and Cody Martin, rookie card. There is one rookie card per pack, the way that I have seen in, in other openings. Seems like you've got one rookie at the very end and uh, you know your one non-base card per pack. Pretty standard on that, so. All right. Got a Clay Thompson base card. Alfred Payton. CJ McCollum. Blake Griffin. Danny Green. And Keldon Johnson, rookie. So no parallels, unless I missed something in there. All seem to be bases and, uh, and rookies on that, so. All right, we've got Lonzo Ball action. Let's put that in the wrong pile there. Pascal Siakam. 
We have a rookie reflections card. It is a DeAndre Hunter and Dominique Wilkins. So you've got, you know, your past historic player there mixed in with a, a rookie card there. It's a cool card design. Like that. Very nice. A Jeff Teague and a Kai Bowman rookie card. So about halfway through here, getting into our last three packs. Jonathan Isaac from the Magic, De'Aaron Fox, Colin Sexton, P.J. Tucker, Lou Williams, and Jalen Wall. I'm going to go back here after and look at all these and really, like I said, take a look at the uh, the design on them because they they're nice. I really do like them a lot. All right, we've got Dennis Schroeder, Oops. Blake Griffin, P.J. Tucker. All right, we've got a rookie, Naz Reed, Alex Caruso, and that was a two-rookie two rookie card pack there. Go go there on that one. All right, so we're down to our last pack here. Nothing, uh, no huge names coming out of there, but still, again, it's so nice to get your hands on some, some basketball retail all right, Thomas Bryant, Paul George, Bogdan Bogdanovich. This is a nice looking one here. Cam Reddish, that is really nice looking. I don't, I'm, it's got a different design. Do not know the type of card design on this. I can't read it. Instant Impact. Okay, so it's an Instant Impact card there. In, insert for Cam Reddish. Kawhi Leonard, Hachimura, I always butcher his last name, rookie card there. So overall, it did pretty well in terms of, at least from, from my point of view, I've got, you know, I like to collect the rookie cards. We've got some nice base cards, and these are cards that I haven't had, like this design, like I said before, haven't opened illusions. I don't know if they're a product that's around every single year, but that was a lot of fun. I, again, thank you so much to be able to open that. It was awesome for me. I will go back through. I look at each and every single card. I like to read the back of them because with basketball being my favorite sport, I really just, I love everything about the cards themselves. I mean, it's just, it's a, it's a personal connection to me on that, but that's going to do it for this video. Relatively quick video here, quick opening. If you're lucky enough to get your hands on these, I, I encourage doing so. Try not to go over the top in terms of, uh, you know, I, I don't recommend paying too much above retail for them. If you're looking through eBay or whatnot, because you're probably not going to get your, your value back on that. Not always. I mean, you might, but it's, it's so hard to say, you know, there's no guarantees that you're going to get your value back on that. And I hate to see people spend their money praying that they're going to get money back on that when there's just, there's just no guarantee. So, but I hope that that was a fun opening for you guys to take a look at the product. If you're able to get your hands on it, if you have any questions, put it in the comment section below, but thanks so much for stopping by the channel. We'll be back with another video in the near future. Thanks guys. Take care.